Oh, it's the mayor's kid. It's the mayor's kid. Oh no. Greetings and salutations, everybody. My name is Hafro. Welcome back to the channel. And today we are going to be starting uh, maybe a new series. It depends. It depends on how well this video does. But I did want to watch this and kind of react to it and see if uh, there is any interest in it. So today we're going to be watching Resident Alien. It is a new show on the Sci Fi channel. I'm a big Sci Fi fan myself. And the stars Alan Tudyk, who is one of my favorite actors. Uh, he usually does um, like minor characters, support characters. He hasn't really had. A lot of lead stuff so i'm really looking forward to seeing him in a lead role here he plays this uh alien character who i guess is hiding out in like a small town and he's uh, playing a doctor i guess so uh, i'm sure that some hilarity ensues here so i'm not sure what the full plot of the story is i just kind of know that fact and i've seen like his alien look as well so looking forward to getting into that and seeing what that's about if you enjoy uh this reaction and you want to see more of them please comment down below let me know that you want to see more of them um or this may be a one-off well we'll see what happens as always, if you enjoy my content, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Uh, and you can hit that notification bell to know when my videos go live. I know I haven't been posting um, in a set schedule lately. Uh, my life's been kind of crazy, so I apologize for that. Um, and you can also follow me on my socials at Thunder, both Twitter and Instagram. I don't post a lot, especially with uh, quarantine and COVID happening, but hopefully maybe I'll be able to post uh, some interesting stuff soon. I, I <laughs> When I'm home alone, there's really no reason for me to post anything. But yeah, uh, so let's go ahead and jump into this reaction and let's see what the show is all about. It is very pretty. The sun warms the earth somewhere. <laughs> somewhere not here. Okay. Four frozen sodas just exploded in my truck. So, sounds like uh, where I live here in the Mid Midwest. <laughs> oh, it's Colorado. Okay. I was born there. <laughs> Nobody in their right mind would live in a place like this. Unless they have something to hide. <laughs> nice. Nice. Oh, okay. Get a little intro. Oh. <laughs> Oh, oh, oh. Is does he eat brains? I'm everybody calls me Big Black. Because of your truck. Cause... <laughs> or uh, deputy deputy <laughs> She she's a little smitten with the uh, Alan Tudyk. Yeah, well, see that's the thing. The victim is the town doctor. Oh. <laughs> well, okay. That's a good way to, to explain that. Does he end up becoming the town doctor? That'd be interesting. So I wonder how... Okay, we're gonna get some backstory. I would have to somehow fit in with the human life forms. And that mission was... Does he take over Alan Tudyk's body? Is that what happens? Oh, that's, uh, okay, okay, he's a lot taller. Wow. He is a giant. Oh, don't make him mad. That's not good. Ooh. E. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was not expecting to, to have little tiny hands there. <laughs> oh, ooh. He's, he's probably dead. Okay, well that answers my question. It's not like a glimmer or something where people just see what he wants to see. It's he actually, like, is able to transform his body into it. That's, uh... That's uh, definitely a cool power. I got this, uh, uh, of this. Huh, interesting. So he had to like learn everything. Uh... When my ship crashed, I lost precious cargo. A device I need to complete my mission. But what is the device? Tell us. You can tell us. Plus they don't have a pizza place and the internet said that parking was a nightmare. <laughs> Humans would land right below lizards. 
Below lizards, huh? Okay. You're not dead. Yeah, no shit. I was sleeping. Uh, she's not the dead doctor. He's over there. <laughs> uh. I'm Harry Vanderstiegel. I'm a doctor. Mayor Snowflake had them bring me down to look at the dead body. Please don't. He's he's very kind of kind of he's got that alien monotone voice going. I, I'm interested to see if it uh, evolves over time. Tell someone their husband died. Yeah, I'll give him my number. I'll tell he's dead. I don't give a shit. <laughs> uh, I like this guy. Well, uh, I feel like stabbing is likely cause of death. A good mystery, figuring out what happened. Like law and order. Dun -dun. <laughs> nice. <laughs> this is so weird. Alright, look, that's one creepy son of a bitch. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Don't tell me that you're leaving. Okay, I won't. <laughs> but he's still leaving. Of course I ran the lab. I knew that I was making a joke. I'm a very funny person. <laughs> uh, I love it. I love it. <laughs> so what? Like, can kids see that he's an alien? I'm what? I, I'm so confused. One in a million humans have the genetic mutation that enables them to see through our molecular reconstruction. Ah, okay. He didn't kill himself. I'm smarter than you. What are you? Was he? Was he maybe uh, defending himself, and the attacker got the upper hand and just used his own hand to kill him? I mean, that's a possibility. If he wanted to kill himself, he would have sliced his carotid. That I'm smarter than a lizard. <laughs> I'm smarter than a lizard. I might have to use that. <laughs> you know, pandas are so stupid. <laughs> what? When they give birth, they're like, what is this? And then they kill their crying baby. Oh, okay, that got dark fast. If that was you returning the compliment, you should try again. I like your brown skin. <laughs> uh, I, I wonder if there's going to be a little romance between the two of them. That might be kind of interesting. I strangled and drowned a guy four months ago, and I have to search the lake for his bloated corpse before some fisherman finds it. Just stop. Just stop. So I wonder if that's what he was doing at the beginning of the episode, was kind of like looking for the body and not actually fishing. Okay, so that kind of explains the beginning uh, intro part, but is it just like he really likes the feel of brains? Or because he didn't say he was going to eat it. It's a very... Good looking brain. Hi, I'm Abigail Hodges, Sam's wife. He's not home. Is he here? <laughs> I'm just sitting here holding his brain. <laughs> oh, that's great. Because you have a pickup truck, and I was hoping you could take me tomorrow to get the rest of my things. I'll buy him dinner for less than that. <laughs> oh, we got a we got a hottie bartender here. Around long enough to find out what it means. Two to fifty-nine. Fifty-nine people died trying to save a child who fell into a mine. Maybe I. I mean, they're taking a shot into the dark. What is that? That's our local whiskey. It's pretty great, right? No. <laughs> I love it. I love it. What <laughs> nice. It's great. Oh. Uh... I mean, don't get me wrong, Alan Tudyk's a very beautiful man, so I, I get why the girls are all for him, but... I mean, I guess in a small town, you know, new cute guy, I can't get it. They're, they're gonna get wasted doing that many shots. <laughs> he's, he's all dancing and stuff because the alcohol's, like, loosening his... 
alien inhibitions. I love it. Oh, he's he's so awkward and bad about it too. Oh no. Oh oh no. Oh. Oh no. They're okay. Okay, she saved him from doing more shots. <laughs> oh, but then she gave him one. Oh no. Oh no. Oh. Oh no. I hope they have more bartenders there because she's just kind of like throwing caution to the wind and drinking with everyone. <laughs> that would be fun, but impractical. Oh, I hope he doesn't uh, drive his truck. Nobody could tell I was different. <laughs> Is he like drink thinking? I'll say one thing about whiskey. Oh, oh, it's allowing oh. me to make <laughs> smart. No, 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 mm, no, okay, mm, not, not good, not. Of course the window's open, of course. Oh, what's gonna happen here? That's, oh, does, is he just able to, like, move his body weirdly because the uh, genetics or something? Okay, that's probably a stunt double. I really hope he doesn't end up killing this kid. That would be bad for, like, his character. What's going on? There's an alien on the bed! Let's go, sweetie. Come on. Oh, it's the mayor's kid. It's the mayor's kid. Oh, no. <laughs> I <laughs> gave him the finger. Oh no. Yep, that that's what a hangover is called, buddy. Headache, nausea, severe dehydration. He's going to forget to go uh help her move, isn't he? Alcohol must not affect humans the way it does us. If it did, they obviously would never drink it. No, no, it does affect him the way it does you. We just don't care. We like the sensation. Yeah, I, I figured I figured that's what happened. I mean, to be able to hum and beatbox at the same time, that's actually kind of good skills he's got there. <laughs> She's riffing. Is the ex gonna come out and be like, Does your new boyfriend now? The small syringe producing the vagina images. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He doesn't know these words. It's great. Oh. There he is. There's the X. So this is the new man. I knew it. I knew it. I knew he was going to say that. It's going to go back. Come on. Go back and beat his ass. No more stupid moves. Oh, we got some human emotion coming from him. You're making me look stupid. No, you don't need my help. Nah, 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 nah. Oh, look, he doesn't have a gun in his pants anymore. <laughs> ah, nice, nice. You gonna tell me how you did that? Did what? <laughs> I, I I love this like he, he must have been working on this like weird alien look for a while because it is great yeah that's totally fake snow that's beautiful oh uh, the Rocky Mountains man I miss them so much Jimmy convinced me we were too young to raise a child so I I gave the baby up for adoption. 
Okay, so didn't get an abortion, but gave the baby up. So I wonder uh, who the kid is. I'm sure we'll meet him at some point. Or her. And a lot of character uh, development in this first episode. Why is everyone in town calling my phone thinking I'm the new town doctor? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I imagine that would have happened. In an hour, he'll be underground with the worms. Mm, so intense. I like it. <laughs> Not for everything. Mike, he needed air. Uh, so he was choking and he tried to give himself a trachea. Oh. Ah, dang. Come, come. <laughs> Huh, so she saw his ship crash. Oh, a buck. Huh. Did she see it and think that that was a sign that she was doing the right thing, maybe? When the miners escaped, they realized there was one man still trapped. Okay, so it was one man, not a like a child or something. And when I do, I can finally complete uh... my mission. Uh, what? Kill them all. Oh, oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> yeah. This is some bullshit. <laughs> uh, okay, well, uh, <laughs> that, that was Resident Alien. I really really liked that uh alan tudyk just has this amazing ability to play these weird one-off kind of kooky characters and just brings so much life and and interestingness to them and it was really fun to kind of see him go from uh just this super super awkward character to still awkward but like the kind of like path he's starting to go along was really cool and we got some backstory into the nurse who i imagine there might be some kind of romantic thing that's going to happen later on so really interested in that uh definitely uh it's been a while since i've seen a story take place in colorado as well so i'm kind of looking forward to that uh look and and, and that feel of it because uh, i was born in colorado and i really uh love the atmosphere and i love i love the people there and so uh definitely looking forward to if if not reacting to the rest of the series at least watching it uh on my own time but uh let me know uh did you like the first episode do you feel like uh, this is a show that deserves uh, me reacting to it let me know in the comments down below let me know if uh you think the end of the series if there ever is an end of the series if you think uh uh alan tudyk's uh, harry character will go through with the extinction event or he'll go against his uh you know people and stop it so uh yeah I i'm glad that we kind of got to know that as well uh, i wasn't sure if they were going to leave that whole his mission until like the end of season one or something like that but uh, they 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 set it right off in the first episode so i imagine they have some more mysteries ahead and we'll see what happens with the uh, uh, the mayor's kid uh, <laughs> if there's going to be some kind of a truce between harry and and him because obviously that would be horrible if he killed the kid so uh and when I feel like in a TV show like this, especially like one that's comedy, yeah, you can have some deaths, but I don't think you really want the lead character committing those crimes unless it's like against somebody who's bad. Like, you know, if, if he had killed um, the nurse's uh, ex-boyfriend, I, I imagine we would have been like, oh my, but we wouldn't have been like totally torn up about it. But, you know, this is an innocent child. So I, I really hope that uh, in order to save the Harry's character as a redeemable character, I don't, I don't think that that's something that should happen. So, uh, yeah. Looking forward to catching the rest of the episodes, and uh, we will catch you with the next reaction.